Right, I can't believe you're sat there all relaxed. I'm manic. Come here, you. Tell me what exactly went wrong in that fitting and then we're going to make sure that that doesn't happen here. I just wanted it out of the way more than anything else. Right, I got, got to a point where I just couldn't bear that feeling of trying any more dresses on and you feeling fat. I have really bad body confidence issues. I always have. That's been one of the biggest points as to why I, I rushed into getting that dress that I did, because I just wanted it over with. So you are not going to go through the same process that you've been through before. Do you see I what I mean? It. So I've chosen this one as your first dress. Ooh. What do you think? Is it not going to show my dimples in my bum? Well, she's stressing, isn't she, because we've only got, like, 71 days. If she doesn't find something and she's got so much little time, I don't think she'll go through with the wedding. I think she will pull out. But you somehow need to find the confidence in you to accept your body because you're getting married in 71 days. I hope so. I know a lot of it is in my head. I look for the negatives in everything in my body. One, two, three. <gasps> is that what I expected? I'm standing here in this beautiful dress, but my heart's pounding out of my chest because I just know full well when I go downstairs, there's gonna be some kind of negativity. After the 15 dresses that I tried on last time and the emotions that I went through, it's a massive deal. I'm the honest one, and she brings me to speak my mind and tell her the truth, what probably nobody else dare tell her. <laughs> I wouldn't let her walk down on the aisle looking a mess. It wouldn't be fair on her. <laughs> right, what do you think? I really like it. And I'm surprised, cos I didn't think I would. I like how it pulls me in. How do you feel about your bum? It does actually feel quite... quite nice. Well, let's spin around, then. It's the moment that we ask... I don't know if I dare. I dare even look at Sarah's face, because <laughs> I just don't know what's going to come out of her mouth. <laughs> Be nice, you. <sighs> right, how can I put this without being awful? <laughs> your stomach's really flat in it. It's not about your stomach, but behind, I can see dimples in your legs and your bum. I knew it. I knew she'd mention the dimples. I don't feel mean by telling the truth, cos at the end of the day, I've, I've got to be cruel to be kind with you, haven't I? I am blown away by that, because genuinely, hand on heart, I think... It might be underneath skirt, it might... Are like you thinking say, about this altering. bit here? It's not, it's not shocking, but I'm just telling you that that's what I can see. Can I get up? Yeah, of course you can. Like here. Okay. There. Well, there, I'm when I do that? Yeah. Isn't that creases in the material? No. Gok and Sarah are like at loggerheads with each other. I think it's at a point where she might actually be offending him. <laughs> I don't know if he's ever met anybody as vocal as me, I don't know. It's all been turned into my dimply bum and not actually about the dress. <laughs> Can you see any back fat? I don't think your bra helps. I, I can't see anything, and I've got a trained eye looking for that kind of stuff. I'm that honest. It just... Caught, it just... It, I spit it out. I just think I can see dimples inside of her legs. This obviously isn't the dress for me. Uh, I'm really concerned now because I just don't know where Gok's going to go next. I've got 71 days to go. There's only going to be a limited amount of dresses that we're going to be able to try. I just really don't know if we're going to be able to achieve what I want by end of today.